Guys, I'm sorry to laugh. Eh? Nas, kuchaka, man, yani, you can imagine eh, mtu anajisambaza ama anajiweka kwenye WhatsApp ama kwenye Facebook ya kwamba yeye ni lesbian. Yeye anajitangaza ya kwamba ni lesbian na anaambia kila mtu ya kwamba ni lesbian na anajitoa hadharani anasema love is love anatoa kid ya rainbow kuonyesha kwamba love is love anaonyesha kila mtu kwamba i'm lesbian eh? i do sex woman to woman yani mimi ni yule wa mwanamke na mwanamke na unajionyesha live na spread information kila mtu aone ya kwamba wewe ni lesbian <laughs> mwisho wa siku uenda leheshwa upatana na mwanaume akupiga kitu alafu ya kurekod na kitu masuji ni telegram si ni wapi kudhirisha kwamba even lesbian also they feel it guys eh? tusidanganywe tusibebe ufuala tusikubali kubebe ufuala kabisa na watu wanaojiita ma lesbians mtu akijiita lesbian saa acha endelee kujiita lakini mwisho wa siku they have feelings as well Mwenyezi Mungu aliumba mwanamke mwanamke na mwanaume mwanaume so ikawaje leo wewe mwanamke unatuambia wewe una, una hisia za kiwanaume mpaka unataka mwanamke mwenzako cha kutubebe ufala of course yes kuna wale ambao walizaliwa hivyo wanasema kwamba uh, since born uh, since by the time walizaliwa walikuwa na hiyo feelings ya kwamba hao ni watu ambao watatamani wana wake wenzako okay fine tutakuelewa we will give you chance on that uh, but ikifikia time sasa unatudhirishia wazi how many lesbians do we have all over the world lakini kuna wale ambao wamejificha kwa sababu sio kupenda kwao wamejipata kule state tayari na we cannot change them what kweli hata ukijaribu vipi hao ni hao hao ni hao there's no way that you can change them but sasa kuna wale ambao wamejiweka ama wameekwa kwa hiyo status alafu mtu unajisambaza kwa mtandao ya kwamba <laughs> wewe ni lesbian na utaki mwanaume. Poko naanza kuita wanaume ni mafala, wanaume siju ni bla bla bla. Au mwisho wa siku mama unanabeba kitu kizito kiasi ya kwamba kila mtu ashangaa lakini huu si alikuwa lesbian huyu. What happening? Na labda umeka mwanamke mwenzako mahali umemwambia bwana wewe sitaki kuona na mwanaume kwa sababu ni wangu. Alafu wewe umeenda pigishwa kitu pako mbibisha mkoko mzito. <laughs> Poleni bwana akakucheka nasikia sijui niseme nasikia raha ama nasikia because i'm happy because imekuwa reveal outside najua kuna ndio pale unaambua unafanya dhambi zako chini ya maji alafu zinakuja zinaonyeshwa hadharani ili kila mtu ajue how liar you are yani ile uongo ambao uko nao unaonyeshwa hadharani kwa sababu you are teaching guys bad yani uko na pia na wrong information that all i can say So guys tuna hii tunaita role model. What is role model? Role model ni ile kipaji ambacho uko nacho. Nitatumia wewe wenyewe vipaji. I'm going to deal with content creators. Kipaji chako ambacho uko nacho unakitumia ili ukuwe role model kwa watu wengine. It's good. Na wengine atasema I'm doing this kama Akothe na kumbuka alisema that uh, she'll not be a role model to anyone kids. Kid yani that is. Lakini mwisho siku jua you have some kids as well wewe pia. Na mwisho siku watoto wako watakuja wataona eh hey, mama ame amefanikiwa na jambo na hili so mimi pia naweza nikafanya hivi na hivi nikafanikiwa je ukiona mtoto wako anafanya kile kitu ambacho unakifanya wewe ku unliving anakifanya je utasikia raha are you going to be happy on that we have to ask ourselves that question as well so kuna wasichana wengi ama kuna mama wengi ama kuna wanaume wengi ambao sana wanapenda ku act kama wanawake they act like women of course yes it's i'm using the word act kwa sababu act ni kujifanyisha kufanya kitendo fulani ni kwa kamera yani unasimama mbele ya kamera, ya kamera kujifanya kuvaa uhusika ambao sio wako lakini sasa huo uhusika unaovaa jua you are role model to someone else mtu akiona mtu fulani amefanikiwa kwa ajili ya hii process mtu atatamani kufanya hiyo process pia ili naye pia afanikiwe je utasikia raha mtu wa kwenu wa kwako mtoto wako watu wa nyumbani wamekuchukua wewe ama wamefanya kile kitu ambacho wafanya ili ku unliving no matter how much you're earning kitu gani we don't care but are you going to be happy if people will come and watu wadogo kizazi kinachokuja kitakuja kikuigize wewe kile kitendo unachokifanya ili au pia wajifaidishe kwa maisha think that way 
think twice na unipe majibu so guys i need you to comment whether is it right uh, for a man to act like a woman just because he want money or he want to be famous so that he can get money je ni sawa mwanamume ku act kama mwanamke ili mradi apate hela ama apate maarufu ama apate pesa ambayo itamkidhi maisha yake is it right is it wrong i'm very much sure kuna vijembe vitapigwa kwa sababu most of the ladies are the ones that they're supporting these guys most of them they're the ones that are supporting these guys unaweza pata mtu ana hustle mtaani anatoa content after content but you never support him you never support him but once ye ni mwanaume akivaa dera akivaa rinda akivaa whatever kia kama wig mnaanza kumsupport kwa sababu yani yani tuna support watu ambao wanafanya ujinga na watu ambao wanafanya vile vitu ambavyo vinatuelimisha hatua support ma pastors wa kanisani wakitoa uh, youtube channel yao ama facebook page yao ili muwafuate muwafollow at least so that mupate ile kitu ambacho anaiongelea eh mashehe wakitoa matube zao wakitoa video zake zile ambazo zinatufundisha we won't follow them hatutawafuata tupate kile kitu ambacho wanatupea ili sisi tu tuchanuke hatutawafuata lakini pasta wa uongo akitoa channel yake ya uongo tutamfuata tutamfuata wengi sana akitudanganya akituambia sijui tuombe tutamka tutapata pesa sijui ameponya kiwetu sijui bla 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 uongo mwingi tutamfuata but yule mtu ambaye anafanya ujinga kwa kamera ndio tunamfuata tumpe support kubwa so mimi nafikiria it's a right time to change and if we want change then kizazi chetu cha mbeleni kitakuja kitaharibika mtanipiga vijembe mtasema whatever we are going to say but that's reality na naenda kusema kwa sababu msema kweli bana you get it so guys please make sure to subscribe and like this video it's kg chipa